how do athletes transport bulky or heavy equipment for the SEA Games? Well, let's look at an example. A four-person kayak can weigh as much as 30 kilograms and stretch 11 meters long. And what does one do in an emergency? Well, Lauren Ong has some of the answers. It's days before the archery team head out to Vietnam. Apart from training, the archers need to start packing their equipment. Going into an international games like the Sea Games is not just about getting yourself there. Madeline, it's quite a process, isn't it? Yes. Uh, usually we unpack our stuff and we take off our site first and then we take off the stabilizers and the bow stand and lastly I put on the bow cover to protect the strings because they are very fragile. To get the bows and parts over to Hanoi, they have packed into a larger travel bag with bubble wraps and fasteners to keep everything in place. We usually ask the archers to swap their spare equipment with another archer so that if one case goes missing, we still have equipment over there for them to compete. But the last time, uh, we were travelling to a South Asian country and even though there was no transit, some of our equipment did not arrive. Uh, that caused quite a panic. It's far more complicated when it comes to canoeing or kayaking. These were shipped from Singapore to Haiphong province in a container, with plans to do so starting as early as three months ago. For the Sea Games, this rig container took more than a month to arrive. It carries 17 boats with at least one spare for each event. It costs about $20,000 for it to be shipped to Vietnam, and it's the same procedure for every major games. A previous delay in 2017 due to bad weather out at sea had caused disruption to team preparations. And if something has uh, probably delayed that shipment, and then we'll go on to uh, activate the contingency plan in terms of uh, securing some of these kayaks from our neighbouring countries who usually help, are helpful enough to give us a hand. So then uh, we would reach out to Indonesia or Malaysia. And in fact, in this uh, container, we also help uh, Malaysia, the Malaysia team to bring two kayaks over. So it's kind of like a goodwill. But other than delays, there are also risks. Dents like these can mean damage to the equipment inside, but thankfully not in this case. After five days of competition, it'll be another feat bringing all of them back to Singapore. Lauren Ong, CNA, Haiphong.